Hello Blade Readers, I'm John Wagner speaking to you from the BG Ice Arena on Saturday. Following the Falcons 3-2 victory over Ferris State, the Bowling Green hockey team completes its sweep of the Bulldogs over the weekend after winning Friday by a score of 2-1. There were similarities on both days, penalties were a problem for BG for example. Luckily the Falcons have one of the strongest penalty killing units in Division I hockey this year. The difference was in the third period, a much stronger performance, very solid performance by the Falcons, leads them to the victory. Bowling Green now 17-6-5 and five on the season. You would expect that they would at least hang on to or stay very near to their number eight national ranking that they came into this weekend with. Even better, they are now 13-4-3 and three in WCHA play. Their 29 points make them a very strong third place in the 10-team league a near lock at this point to host a first round WCHA tournament series. Most importantly though, the Falcons you would expect will hang on to their number eight ranking nationally in the pairwise rankings. Pairwise is how NCAA Division I hockey picks its teams for the tournament. To oversimplify a little bit, the top 16 in pairwise make the NCAA tournament. So the Falcons at number eight have a very strong grip on an NCAA tournament bid. There's a whole lot more information in Sunday's Toledo Blade, online especially at www.toledoblade.com, a game story from Saturday's contest. Much more to come as well. For now, I'm John Wagner. You can follow me at jwagnerblade on Twitter. I thank you for watching and look forward to talking to you again soon.